guilty of the crime of rape by force or fear. Jurors reached verdicts today on four counts of the 12 charges against Kellen Winslow II. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Marcella Lee. And I'm Barbara Lee Edwards. The former NFL player was found guilty of rape, indecent exposure, and lewd conduct. Despite reaching those verdicts, jurors will be back tomorrow for more deliberations on eight other counts. News 8's Amanda Shotsky is live in Vista tonight with more on what happened in court today and Winslow's reaction. Amanda? While this was a major development, it's really just the beginning because the jury only found four of 12 possible verdicts. And I can tell you, Winslow seemed quite surprised by their decision. We, the jury, in the above entitled cause, find the defendant, Kellen Boswell Winslow II, guilty of the crime of rape by force or fear. Kellen Winslow II seemed stunned as a jury found him guilty of raping a 58-year-old homeless woman back in 2018. Guilty of the crime of indecent exposure. After days of deliberations, the jury announced its first four verdicts in the case against the former NFL player. Guilty of the crime of lewd conduct. Three of them guilty, including committing a lewd act in public involving a 78-year-old woman in February, as well as pulling his pants down and exposing himself last year to a 58-year-old woman. He was acquitted on a separate charge of committing a lewd act in public. And I'm pushing with both of my hands. I get the guys to stop. And I just keep telling them to stop. Five women have accused Winslow of sex crimes, several delivering emotional and graphic testimony throughout the course of the trial. You have reached verdicts on four of the 12 counts. That leaves eight uh, counts that have not been resolved. On Monday, the jury went home deadlocked on the remaining eight counts, asking the judge for more time to deliberate. They've been deliberating for five days, but I think it shows we have a very dedicated and conscientious jury. And as a result of today's verdicts, Winslow could face a maximum of nine years behind bars. But if he's convicted of a second rape conviction, then he could face up to life in prison. The jury will continue to deliberate tomorrow. Back to you. Amanda, thank you.